All right, coming up next, it's a UFC women's strawweight division matchup. Drillers make killers, and nobody works her takedowns harder than this young woman. She has become a force in this division, and even though the opposition oftentimes knows what's coming, no one's able to stop that shot. Nobody's able to stop that takedown attempt. No one's able to stop that single leg. She said in the fighter meetings, I have thrown that takedown 5,000 times. Amazing. Over and over, I hit a single leg. Every day of the week, I hit at least 30 single legs. I'm like, well, is wrestling practice every day? She goes, no. I just want to make sure that I have a skill that is so dominant that no matter how much you practice it, you are not practicing it enough to stop me from taking you down with it. It is truly crazy to watch her approach to getting that single leg off. And her ability to get her opponents off balance in a mixed martial arts setting, as special as anybody in the sport right now, we'll see how it goes for her here tonight. Well, she's one of the more well-rounded fighters, DC, that we have in this division. A true mixed martial artist, her first martial art, was MMA, that certainly helps. Yes, she's a new breed of fighter. A fighter that as a young girl, she was brought into a gym, and in that gym she told the coaches, I don't want to wrestle, I don't want to do jiu-jitsu, I don't want to kick, box, and box. I want to do it all. Right. Is there an MMA class for my daughter to take part in? She did that from day one, and you see all that development over the course of a lifetime has led her to the octagon, where she is already making her impact. Yeah, she said, I didn't want to get to the UFC until I was 100% comfortable in every situation. So far, so good for her. She's got a big one in front of her here tonight. Our tale of the tape for this strawweight fight. Four years apart with similar height and reach. All right, now for the introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC strawweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 11 wins, three losses. She stands five feet three inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Amanda Eva! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 13 wins, two losses, and one draw. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. And when the action begins, a referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? All right, so here we go with round one of this highly anticipated affair. And well rounded doesn't even begin to describe it. Both women have every skill in the book. Both of them have every skill in the book. They're so talented. They train so hard. They come from great camp. This is a very even matchup. Oh, the right hand is there for them. And they separate. She told us in our fighter meeting Thursday, at some point I will take her down. She didn't expect it to take this long. She really had to work to get this first takedown, and she never gave up on herself. Continued to press, continued to shoot, continued to level change. Now she finally has secured her first takedown. She's got her back. Get urgent, urgency the word here. You gotta find a way to improve your position. Plus right hand is true. Down to three minutes now to go on the round. Oh, big, big knee. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Oh, big left hook there. Back to the feet. Again, they will clinch. We'll see how it goes. Left hand punch from the clinch. I'm not sure her striking has ever looked better, DC. Another big takedown. Like a potential submission attempt here. Oh! And this 
might just be a matter of time. Finishing instincts as well. You see a lot of fighters get the dominant position, but aren't necessarily able to lock up the choke or force the tap. No problem with her as she gets one of the bigger wins of her UFC career. All right, let's check out some of the action in that previous round. DC, she certainly kept the stat trackers busy with all those takedowns. All those takedowns and some really nice takedowns. She did a great job of level changing, getting into her opponent, not allowing her opponent to defend before she can secure her takedown. Well, she couldn't have drawn it up any better than that as she gets the win by submission tonight. Big win and an even bigger statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 29 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by a tap out due to an arm bar. Well, really nice to see this young woman get a chance to exhale as she celebrates with her coaches. You've won world titles in two divisions, but you're not calling your shot the way she is. She said, I'm going to win this fight by submission, and it goes into the books just that way. That's so much confidence to put yourself out on the limb like that. Nobody is brave enough to say, I'm going to do it here, here.